Hi, Christine here of yesnomas.com and today Paul and I, we are here in Lyon in France and we just did a, we're just doing a quick trip here. We only have a day in Lyon and Lyon is located in the central east of France. It's about two hours away from Geneva, a two hour car ride in Geneva in Switzerland three hours of Turin in Italy and more than four hours away from Paris and here is now a view of Lyon it's the third largest city in France and it's divided by two rivers the Rhone and the Seine and large parts of Lyon are classified as UNESCO World Heritage Site so there's loads to discover so we will try to fit in today quite a lot and the first Roman settlements were here on Bouvier Hill that's where we are right now and that's where you have this beautiful panoramic view and up there is the Basilica and we will just show you now the other side of the Basilica behind me you can see the Basilica of Notre Dame de Fouvière that's the church for Mary. It was built between 1872 and 1884 and Pierre Bourson, he designed it. Also here at the Basilica you can just see down there the Tour Métallique de Fouvière. That's the tower, its own they say, like Eiffel Tower of Lyon. And it's similar to the third floor of the Eiffel Tower. It's 85.9 meters high and it's actually the highest point of Lyon and it used to be an observation tower but nowadays it's just used as a TV tower. We are here now in the heart of the ancient Lugdunum Roman city and we're still on Fouvier Hill. It's not far from the Basilica, it's just up there. We are now here in the heart in the entertainment center and Paul if you just t show the theater this is a theatre, it could accommodate 10,000 people. Down there on this side you can see the museum. It's filled with Roman artefacts on several levels. It's actually five levels. And on the other side you can see the Odeon. The Odeon is a bit smaller than this big one here. It has only a seating capacity of 3,000 people. And it was specialised in giving musical and poetry performances. And we were very lucky because when we were there, there was actually a performance shown there. And we will just show you a few bits from this performance uh, with an orchestra and kids doing the play. So enjoy that for a moment. On the other, the second hill of Lyon, there are only two, that's La Croix Rose. And on this hill you can find the amphitheatre of the Three Gauls, that's just the one behind me. It's not as impressive as the one on the Fouvier. So, and this amphitheatre, it relates to the three regions of Roman France named Lugdenius, Belgica and Aquatica. Yes. We are here now in Vieux Lyon, that's the old Lyon, and after Venice it is the largest Renaissance area in Europe. And the typical architectural feature of Lyon's historical buildings 
are these trabouilles, and the trabouilles, they, these are corridors that link two streets through a building together. So you can literally walk through the building into the next street. And there is generally also a courtyard in between. And most of them, they are privately owned buildings, so they might only be open in the morning. And yeah, you can just see and walk through them. This is a trompe oulier. That's French for deceive the eye. That's an ancient art technique that creates an optical illusion. So the objects, they appear three-dimensional. And Lyon is also the capital of this three-dimensional art technique. And if you look closer, then you can see it on a variety of buildings here. And the most famous one is this one here, La Fresque de Lyonnais. Um, this is near the Somme River. Thank you.